This next routine is going to be a great workout in toning your buttocks and your sacrum and also your legs. Uh, we will be using weights for this again, and you'll just want to put maybe a two pound on or a three pound at the max. But what we're really looking for here is you being able to isolate and really concentrate on very specific muscles, prevent yourself from um, contracting your mid back and your neck and shoulders. You want to keep it all down into the lower part of your body, down past your hips and your glutes, and also into the sacral area, going right into the joints and into your legs. So you're going to have a chair against the wall, creating that dynamic effect of the wall coming into your chair and then right back into your body. Now your ling will begin to come up. We're having her feet on the chair. She's going to raise your body up into a beautiful bridge. Now with that, she'll have her feet a little bit apart, allowing herself to take her hips and lift it and push away. So that way, the further you can push your hips um, forward, the more you're going to be able to contract into the sacrum. And you want to go into sacrum because that's where it really affects into your hip alignment and being able to balance your hips and stabilize your hips down to your buttocks. Really great way of toning your buttocks and into your thigh. Great workout. As she's holding that and she's having her hand placed on the floor, she'll just exhale a little bit and really concentrate into that triangle area right into the sacral area as she's contracting pushing away with the balls of her feet, bone on bone here, bone to her feet all the way up to her hips. Now she's going to lower her hips down a little bit and push away back up and contract again. Try to keep your legs completely relaxed when you do this exercise so that way you're really focusing on your sacrum and contracting the muscles in your sacrum, pushing away on a five, good. Allow your hips to open up every time you come up. Four beautiful exercise here. You want to do three reps of maybe um, eight and work yourself up to higher numbers. Contracting on two, exhale. And again, one more time, contracting and lifting and pushing forward. Exhale real deep and really get into that last bit of stretch you can right into your sacrum. From there, we're going to finish up with a little challenge if you want. You have on your feet come together. And then with that, she's going to go ahead and um, having her feet close together, she's going to be able to really contract deep into her sacrum. She's going to take her right leg up to the ceiling, taking that right leg all the way up and contracting really deep. And then what you're going to do is you can just lower down your hips a little bit and take your leg back up. So as you can see, that, that right foot's going straight up to the ceiling and it's staying like that. And she's going up and down with just her left leg to contract deep into the right buttock and into the right thigh all the way down into the um, fascia lata. Beautiful work on exhale on a two. Again, a little bit of rep, build yourself up to it, a little bit of weight at the same time. One more time, bring your leg up and hold. Good, and bring your leg back down. Open your feet apart again, pull your chest and open up into a beautiful bridge. One more time, contracting deep, balancing your right side to your left and holding that. And from there, you can do the opposite leg if you want while you're there. And then exhale and bring your body down. 